here is the next example of combination of lenses so in this example a diverging lens with a focal length of negative 14 centimeter so remember one important thing the diverging lens is always will have i mean a negative focal length that indicates that um let me let me go through the question minus 14 centimeters is placed 12 centimeters to the right of a converging lens so here is a converging lens and here is a diverging lens okay so he said the diverging lens is right side of the converging lens and the distance between these two is 12 centimeter okay now what is the focal length for the diverging lens minus 14 centimeter so basically uh, let me take this as one and two so second lens has focal length somewhere there which is 14 centimeters so negative indicates that the focal length is in front of the lens okay so the next one the converging lens has a focal length of 18 centimeters so f1 is 18 centimeters somewhere there Okay, that's a given data an object is placed 30 cent 33 centimeters to the left of the converging lens so as I remember always I put the object on the left hand side of the uh, lens so distance of object 1 is 33 centimeter so question is find the final location of the image and the magnification factor so for the first one lens one i'm going to use the lens equation one over distance of object one plus one over f1 sorry one over distance of object image one equal to one over f1 so one over distance of image one let me write it down one over distance of image one equal to one over 18 minus one over 33 that value will give you distance of image 1 equal to I have that value as 39.6 centimeters so basically since I end up with the distance of image 1 as a positive number so it must be located um, somewhere behind here what is the magnification factor let me do this minus distance of image 1 over distance of object 1 which is minus 39.6 over 33 that magnification factor is negative 1.2 I end up with the negative number so basically the final I mean the image of the first one is going to be inverted um, since it is image I'm going to draw a dotted line so here is the distance of image 1 which is 39.6 centimeter now for lens 2 remember uh, image of first lens is going to act like a object of second lens okay. at the same time that object must be on the left hand side but you have it on the right hand side so I'm going to take that as a negative number so this is distance of object 2 what is the distance of object 2 distance of object 2 is distance of image 1 minus 12 okay um, let me take this as reverse because it is on the behind the second lens minus 39.6 27.6 minus centimeters so 1 over distance of object 2 plus 1 over distance of image 2 equal to 1 over f2 so this value is 1 over distance of object 2 minus 27.6 plus 1 over distance of image 2 equal to minus 1 over 14 centimeter so 1 over distance of image 2 is negative 1 over 14 
plus 1 over 27.6 I have this distance of image to equal to a negative number 28.4 centimeter so the image is going to be you end up with a negative number so it ma it is going to be in front of the second lens give me one minute let me find m2 let me take this as m1 m2 equal to minus distance of image 2 over distance of object 2 minus of minus 28.4 divided by object 2 is minus 27.6 okay so you finally you will end up with a negative number so negative 28.4 divided by 27.6 now uh, i end up with m2 as negative 1.028 the final magnification factor is 1.234 so we, we end up with the final magnification factor as a positive number uh, but let me see how it's going to work so here distance of image 2 is 28.4 centimeters negative so it's it's going to be somewhere here and it is going to be inverted so this is the object for the First second lens so the image of that lens is going to be somewhere here which is uh, 28.4 centimeters so it's going to be somewhere there this distance is 28.4 which is distance of image to centimeters now I mean I have m2 as inverted so basically the picture I mean the final image is going to be inverted again so we are inverting twice so it's going to be up upright okay so the final image is 1.23 times bigger than the object and it is a bit closer than the I mean it's look like so it's a virtual image basically this image is uh, looks like it is little bit closer to the camera now in the same example let me do one more um, in the same example what i'm going to do i'm going to increase the distance between the two lenses as well as i'm going to change distance of the object so let me do part two so for lens one one over uh, distance of object 1 plus distance of image 1 equal to 1 over f1 so 1 over distance of image 1 is nothing but f1 1 over f1 which is 1 over 18 minus distance of object 1 is 10 centimeters so I end up with the distance of image 1 is negative 22.5 centimeters so I have a negative number so that means the image is on the front side and uh, since it is a, a negative number m equal to minus distance of image 1 over distance of object 1 which is negative of negative 22.5 divided by 10 which is positive 2.25 so magnif this is m1 so this is going to be look like 2.2 times 2.25 times bigger than the object and this is 22.5 centimeters away so this is distance of image 1 which is 22.5 centimeters now for lens 2 we know that that is the object so for lens 2 image of lens 1 is same as image of uh, image of lens 1 is I mean so the distance let me rewrite that again sorry image of lens 1 is nothing but object of lens 2 so distance from for the object 2 is so you have image 1 as 22.5 centimeters in front of the lens 1 so that 22.5 plus distance between them is 16 so 38.5 centimeter so I end up with the distance of image 2 as negative 10.266 centimeters so I have a negative number here so that means I will end up image is going to be um, somewhere here but let me find the magnification factor to find out whether it is inverted or not m2 equal to minus distance of image 2 over distance of object 2 
minus of negative 10.266 over 38.5 so my m2 i end up with a, a positive number uh, which is 0.266 so it is only 0.266 times of the uh, image of image of the first lens or total magnification factor is 0 0.6 so basically it is only 0 0.6 times of the object size of the object now distance of image 2 I have negative 10.66 so it's going to be somewhere here so this is distance of image 2 since it's a negative number it is in front of the in front of the lens okay I'm going to stop this video here I'm going to make two more videos with uh, two other combinations thank you